So plans to build a public market in Madison are moving forward today. A new committee is going to meet later on today to talk about what that market on First Street in East Wash might look like. That's where we find News 3 this morning. Reporter Eden Checkel this morning. She has more on what we can expect from that meeting later today. Hi there, Eden. Hi, Adam and Danica. Good morning. Yeah, so the public market is expected to open in spring of 2019, but Mayor Paul Soglin says that before that can happen, a number of steps need to be taken to move this project forward. Its top priority right now is coming up with a design plan. Now, in these meetings, the committee will also sort out how the market will be operated. They'll select vendors and find management that will work with the vendors. According to the 2017-2018 Capital Improvement Plan, the public market is expected to cost a total of $13 million. Up to 30% of the funding for this project would come from a new markets tax credit, which is a federal program. Now the mayor is expressing concerns about whether that program will still be running. A big part of the financing for the public market is the use of tax credits, and those tax credits are up in the air because we don't know what the Trump administration's going to be doing in that area. Overall funding for the project will come from the city's capital budget, private donations, potential state and federal grants, and tax credit. Now, Soglin says he wants the public market to provide people with affordable, fresh, and nutritious foods. And that meeting is scheduled today at 4.30 at the City County Building in Room 108. And the public is invited to attend to uh, voice their opinions as well on this project. Back to you. A long time in the making here. Eden Checkle reporting live from east mm -hmm. side of Madison this morning. Thanks, Eden.